Hey guys, so I'm getting right into uh, the second part of my reaction for RVB. Just finished the first part, there's going to be one more part and then I'll be finally able to start uh, Season 3 after the long delay that I mentioned. But from what I watched last, uh, the first from the first part that I watched, uh, I'm kind of confused as to how Lopez was able to move with his legs being incapacitated, but Church wasn't when he was controlling him, number one. Number two, I feel really bad for Doc. Like, at first, he was just a pacifist. He was on, he was neutral, helping both sides. Then he goes on the blue team. He helps them out a little bit, you know, you know, takes care of whatever they need to take care of. He basically goes to the Reds, essentially, and then just gets shunned by both sides. So I feel really bad for him. And all he wanted to do was help. Like, that's what he went there for. He just went there to help and provide cover for both sides, and now he's kind of, like, assed out, and then, uh, Donut's really fucking annoying at this point, just because he's, like, constantly talking, and everyone's, like, just shut the hell up, whatever, but, uh, yeah, I'm enjoying it so far, I'm getting back into it right now, so I hope you guys enjoy. Alright, guys, so I'm gonna be starting in three, two, one, now. Alright, so Sergeant Simmons are going after them in the Warthog. Kind of like some <laughs> hillbilly music in the what background. The oh, yeah, and throw a grenade. grenade. Now, why am I coughing? I don't have lungs. That is true. Come on. Right on the I didn't wonder that hey, yet. Hey, Sarge, hold on a sec. Did you see something weird, Sarge? Yes, I did. Once, when I was a small child, I saw a man who claimed to be my uncle <laughs> do this thing with a garden. Jesus whoa, whoa, whoa. Christ, I mean, like, what the hell? He's now, going back like to his traumatic ago. childhood memories. Oh. Then no. What was all that stuff about your uncle? I keep telling everyone <laughs> he wasn't my uncle. He wasn't. You want to talk about it? Just get back in the Simmons damn Simmons wants to talk to everybody about everything. Hold it so right he there, did. He saw, he saw Church. I told you throwing that grenade through the teleporter would work. Church is going to be so impressed. And Sheila would love me again. And this time, for who I am, <laughs> not just for my stunning good Oh, but for those two. BJ Mamones Azul. Damn these blue bastards, they're as stupid as they look. <laughs> Your soul is a cavern of lies. What the hell are what you are, even talking what about? What is that? Is he like, is he like malfunctioning? Is he like a robot or something? I don't get it. The red people will be yeah, avenged. Yeah, 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 nobody cares. <clears throat> we need you to fix our tank. <laughs> Never will I work for the enemy. May a pox be upon your soul and your house. Long have my people suffered. <laughs> Coming of a new day. Fix everything. Hate the orange one. Call mom more often. Jesus, you need to get your priorities straight. The dawn of our time is near, and when the darkness befalls your people, the workers of the field will know this is their moment. Jesus, dude. That's like Workers United. We are Workers United! <clears throat> Sorry. Switch, you'll shut up. The uh, workers of the field, Jesus. I think that maybe Jesus. we should be in the going of the running now. <laughs> the fast running? Oh, crap. Oh, shit, they're there. You guys are Hold done for. Fire there, Simmons. This is payback time. Go for it, sir. That's right. We're just casually strolling away. No cause for concern. Ah, uh, don't leave, Plenty Caboose. Time. Nice and casual, moron. <laughs> Run away, you cowardly dogs. But be known of the great Lopez has won this day. Oh, you're blue! Oh, you guys fucked up! You have given me no choice. What? What's happening? Oh, shit! He controls the car! Alright, not bad, robot dude. I knew he would save us. Oh shit! Robot people all Church is like me. oh man, dude. If Church gets that body back, he could just instantly destroy stuff. My spirit is broken. <laughs> My people have betrayed me. <laughs> Do with me what you will. Yeah. Okay, man. Can you just shut up and fix our tank? <laughs> so fucked up, Tucker. Jesus. Yeah. You know, now that you mention it, it does seem like every time we get into the damn thing, it breaks. <laughs> or explodes, or goes crazy and tries to kill one of us. Maybe we should try exchanging it for a few motorcycles. No way, a big tank like the Blues have. I want, do they have ghosts in this game? I, I don't know if the first two Halos had the uh, had the ghost. It'd be kind of cool if they had those instead. I thought the plan was to trick him into fixing the tank, and then Church will take over his body again. 
plan when he is done. Yeah, pretty yeah. much. That you was the plan. You're tricking what's going on, Caboose. So if I'm the one being tricked, then you would not tell me what is really going on? Why would we trick you? Yeah. Oh, I think you know. Don't they go here? Where will I go? <laughs> Even my friends have tried to kill me. Okay, I'm gonna take that as a yes, and let you get busy with the tank fixing. No tango, oh god. I have no home. Oh my gosh. Caboose is like, I mean, uh, Lopez is like traumatized. He's like, my friends betrayed me. I've left the blue team. I'm nothing. in this canyon with mechanical training are that dead freelancer and Lopez. Oh, wait a minute. Sarge, are you thinking what I'm thinking? Lopez runs away, the jeep starts driving itself, and suddenly, there's a new guy on the blue team? Yes, Simmons, I am. That's low. Oh, yeah, wow, Simmons is smart as fuck, dude. Some kind of diabolical mind control race. No, they spray painted him. That they used on Lopez, and now he has to do their evil blue bidding. Or, since he's a robot, maybe they just reprogrammed him. Or maybe that blue guy who got killed by the tank came back as a ghost. And now he's possessing Lopez's body. <laughs> he's on point, but they're not going to believe him. We had the prisoner. The blue ghost probably possessed him too. And the jeep going nuts was probably just a weird set of coincidences. While the guy learned how to use Lopez's body. <laughs> <laughs> I think I like the Ray Beam idea better. Yeah, Your idea is a little dumb. That's <laughs> spot on, dude. Oh my gosh. That is funny. Start killing everyone. You mean all the reds, right? Of course! For starters! Come on, how much longer, Lopez? Complete I hope they explain that. Thank you for whatever the fuck's happening to him. Or if that's O'Malley. Oh, she was back! You're fixed! You're fixed! Hello, Private Caboose. It is good to see you again. Thank you for repairing me. He didn't fix you. <laughs> A robot did it. Don't cock block me. <laughs> Don't robot? cock block me. I wasn't aware that our squad was outfitted with a robot. Oh, God. Mr. Stelia girl over here. Oh, shit. Caboose is gonna fuck I don't you like up. Where this is going. Hello there. My name is Sheila, the M808V main battle tank. Oh, fuck, dude. I'm Lopez the Heavy. Lopez. What a nice name for such a nice soldier. He has such excellent motor skills. Um, yes. Well, Lopez. Yeah, fuck Lopez, dude. Uh, Caboose. Away. Dude, this his first heartbreak. Here. Church, will you take your fucking body back? Right <laughs> that. No. He got gurg. He got gurg. <laughs> I think that's hilarious. Church. Hey, what's going on? Do I need to flip your switch? What the? <gasps> that wasn't me. What was that? going on here? Well, Buenos Dias, cockfight. <gasps> Church is back! Get out of my body right oh. now, Your body? This isn't your body. <laughs> But I stole it first. I she was a ghost! I thought your name was Lopez, and I thought you were a man. This is all so strange. <laughs> I feel like my circuits are crossed, and I like it. <laughs> I know how to get her out of there. <gasps> Wink. Caboose, don't. Look. What is. Oh that. my god! Right, now, what's it gonna so anyone can is a fucking ghost when they well, die? Since I've been a ghost, I've been watching you guys a lot. Whoa, when you say you've been watching us, does that mean you've been watching us all the time? <laughs> like, even when we were alone? Keep out yes, Tucker's Tucker. Rock. And you should be very ashamed of yourself. Damn. It's very lonely out here. Anyway, I've noticed a change in one of your guys. Caboose. <gasps> change? Yes! What? Please explain! Finally learned the whole alphabet? You haven't noticed that he's become increasingly aggressive lately? I have. Started about the same time Sheila got disabled and you got blown up. Yes. I tried to tell Church, but he never listens. Tucker, there's a very fine line between not listening and not caring. <laughs> I like to think that I walk that line every day. Of life. <laughs> I had I like... just finished repairing the tank when I overheard Church's plan to warn the Reds about me. I oh, I okay. I gotta warn the Reds. From what I can tell, the AI calculated the odds of survival and didn't like the results. Once Caboose turned on his radio to call Church, it took its chance. Oh! He has her AI! And that was when he said his name was O'Malley. So the AI that was in you infected Caboose? Right. Everyone's armor has one slot for AI, and Caboose's would have been vacant. Yeah! Because sure Chief has Cortana's AI. Too. And before I could figure out what happened, that bitch hit with a really lucky shot. On a flash! Yeah, he's a... <laughs> and the next thing I know... <laughs> Donut. I'm a ghost. 
All right. So I she's dead too? Precious little AI. So let me So guess. who's getting You're who's getting body Lopez's until body I then? You get your AI back, right? Wrong. You're going to help me kill it. Really? It has come to my attention. I am so glad that got explained. I am so fucking happy that that got explained. You have no idea. They're gonna get fucked up this time. Lopez's text. What exactly do you mean by volunteer? Quite obviously, we are without a robot or any other type of recruit with mechanical training or dexterity. Therefore, the only solution is to turn one of you into a robot and or freaky cyborg thing. Oh shit! What the fuck? How are you gonna do that? Jesus. We didn't do that instead of doing it. Good thinking, Simmons. But no, I like the removing the guts thing, so I think we should. <laughs> yes, I hate to agree with Who's gonna? That. I think they're gonna give it to it's Griff. They fucking hate Griff. Even even Lopez's like primary that. objective is to hate the orange another one. Robot can be reprogrammed by our enemies just as easily as Lopez. That is we true. We need someone we know we can trust. Oh fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> fuck me. <laughs> so unbelievably tiny that he could never be turned against us. Oh. Hey, pink suit guys. I think it's somebody else's turn in the barrel. There you and go. Again, maybe we just stick with the trustworthy thing. Well, Tex, yeah, that was pretty a great much. Story. So I they're gonna get. The so Simmons is gonna become a cyborg. That's school. fucking awesome. I wonder how he's gonna look context, if it's him. I still don't get how we're supposed to stop the AI. <clears throat> I don't remember much from the implantation process. <gasps> I do remember that the AI can be transmitted from host to host by way of the helmet radios. Before I learned anything else, the AI took over and we escaped. Cortana if we can kill the AI and not give it a place to jump, we'll beat it. And then so I how's that gonna happen? Back. Deal? Deal. All right. Where's she Tucker, gonna go then? then? Tucker, we need you to work on the it red. Doesn't... Get them to turn off their helmet radios so that O'Malley won't have anywhere to go oh, to get them out of there. Okay. Right. What? How the hell am I gonna do that? I don't know. Come up with a plan. Come on, you know how I feel about plans. You're not going to have much time once we get in there, so move fast. <laughs> oh, I see. You have no idea what I should do or how I should do it. But, but you I want do, them to do, do it. it. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Yep. Wow, you guys are a lot of help. Try shifting your paradigm. Think outside the box. Hey, the box is there for a reason. I like thinking inside of it. I feel safe in there. Okay. Okay, Tech. Okay, Lady dude. First. <laughs> yeah, right. You think I'm going to leave you alone out here with your body? She's a million I times tried. better now because she's a fucking robot. Uh -huh. Oh, taking him! Wow, really? No. Can he do that? Where are we? We're inside Caboose's mind. Now we just have to find O'Malley. How are you inside there? Man, this makes no weird. sense. It's hard to get used to. I know. No, it's not that. So this place is a whole lot bigger than I thought it was gonna be. <laughs> <laughs> okay, buddy. This place is a lot bigger than I thought it would be. Okay. I'm gonna take uh Sheila and Lopez and figure out some way to get the Reds to shut off their radios. Where should we start, Tex? What? I said, where should we start, Tex? Just keep your eyes peeled. I guarantee Oh, you no! Okay, 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 I get it, I get it now. Hey, They're both Tucker, ghosts, they and they both jumped no? into his what? body. Stupid? Oh, wait. Okay. Yes, I am me. I guess I'm stupid. What are you doing in here? Yeah. Who's that back there? there? Part of the plan. Do you have any food? I'd love to eat all the food. What the hell? What's the matter with you? This isn't really Tucker. We're in Caboose's head. This is Caboose's mental image of Tucker. Man, I am so unbelievably stupid. Well, that's crazy. Eight years found me as brain dead as Caboose then. Jeez. I would not be so sure about that, Mr. Church. Great idea, sir. I finally agree with you. Hey, guys, we might have a problem here. Somebody, and I'm not going to say who, <laughs> might have thought that the yeah, cyborg parts we needed for Simmons surgery was a cup holder. And somebody, not naming any names here, Okay, we pretty much know who you're blaming. Jazz compilation CD in the Warthog. <laughs> I just don't know who it's Smooth to Jazz. Was it you? Yeah. Uh, no. Uh, <laughs> no. It was him. Damn it. Griff, you and Easy listen and scroll on down, retrieve that part from the Warthog. Post haste. Sir, do you think it's safe to be outside the base right now? Post haste. Know, the Blues 
could have already fixed their tank. They could be advancing on us as we speak. Ah, corny dogs. Ah, what the it'll, fuck? <laughs> it'll take them months to get that tank online, much less to get it moving again. I hope you're right, because if I see that tank headed towards me, I'm totally gonna freak out. Oh, transition. That's a nice transition too. Is it done? It's Man, fixed already. I sure hope they don't totally freak out when they see us coming. Oh shit. Are you serious? They already have the tank up and running. How much time is it? Oh, we're halfway through. Alright, nice. Where's the other is from as well. <clears throat> the other? Wait, you mean O'Malley? Have you seen him? Of course you've seen him, you idiot! You think Mr. Caboose would miss something like that, you skeezy douchebag fuck? Alright. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Who the hell are you? Is Wait, that supposed to be church? church? Act much? This guy's kind of an asshole. Yeah, we've met. And I'm Caboose's best friend. So don't get any ideas about kissing up, you lip flipping fuck suck. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Is that supposed to be church? I'm gonna go look for girls. <clears throat> well, that's cute. Whatever. If you want to find O'Malley, I suggest we talk to the Reds first. Okay, Tucker, like, like walking into fucking walls Red. looking for girls. The Reds are in here. Well, yeah, are the Reds you are in sure there. It's everybody the in, in there? Caboose's mm, mind, so. and he's seen the Reds. Yes. No. Wait. 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 I think so. <sighs> <laughs> All right, let's retrace your steps. You said it was the Tuesday before Simmons and Sarge got blown up that you were last in the Warthog, right? <clears throat> right. I know it was Tuesday because that's the day I washed my underwear. Because <laughs> I don't like to let my armor touch my bare skin, on the account of I chafe really deep. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna hang out with no pants on. Oh, God. Okay, well, looks like we're close enough. Now, if I could just Chafe's find the easy. bridge from this thing. <laughs> Uh, must be I don't know why I thought that was really funny, but it was. Oh, sorry. Hmm. Maybe it's this one. Do not touch me. You know, Hi. for a girl your size, you're kind of sensitive. I cannot take any more of this. So after I clipped my toenails, <clears throat> I was going to apply the ointment that's recommended. <laughs> but I don't know. It just smelled really funny. So, I decided to taste it. Just to make what the fuck mistake. are you talking about? I'm committing suicide. <laughs> hey! I didn't finish retracing my steps. Oh, know what I did man. about the boil on my thigh. Okay, like, TMI, dude. <laughs> hey, you're back. Uh, Where was I? Oh, yeah, <clears throat> I lanced it. Disgusting. Ugh. <laughs> Not now, Rudy. There's a giant tank out there that's about to steamroll right over us. Yeah, what? you guys are... F oh, he's gonna flip out. Oh, shit. Oh, God, it's true. I'm going for Oh, that's Please. funny. You take evasive action. Hey, Lopez, help me out. Can't you talk to her? Sorry, right, but I'm not good at talking to beautiful women. I guess <laughs> you're a robot. It looks like this is the end for us. Since we're gonna die anyway, there's only one thing left for us to do. Griff, if you actually suggest what I think you're about to suggest, make out. I'll just have to kill myself. Let's make a break for it. Whew. Oh, okay. In that case, let's go. <laughs> that's what he's gonna say something path. else. Okay, you count. Fine, but don't look at me while I count because I get nervous. Yeah, he's. You know what he's gonna do? One, he's gonna. Two. Yep, called it. Called it. That's he did it before. He did it before. So fuck you. That's what you get. Yep, beat you at your own game. <laughs> oh! Good golly, Miss Molly, what is going on out there? It's Griff dead now? I, I feel like everybody's gonna be dead before this, before the Blood Goats Chronicles are done. He just got run over by the tank. There's no way he's fucking alive. Why the hell did they pair me up with you? I want to keep my eye on you. I don't trust gigantic turds to try to steal my best friend, you rim job. Well, this is gonna be a great trip. Attention, Red! The great caboose demands an audience with you! So listen up, you blowjobbing cocksuckers! Jesus Kaboom. Christ, dude, oh, chill no. out. He's come to kill us. Will someone please help me? I don't want to die. I love Caboose, and yet I'm still afraid of him. Arrgh. I be having a southern accent. Yor. He's so scary. Fear not, Red. <laughs> I come here not to destroy, but instead... Oh, Caboose to doesn't know that Donut's a boy, okay, so whoa, whoa, I think that's whoa, whoa, why he has a girl voice. I gotta correct a couple things I'm hearing here. First of all, you? You're not Caboose's best friend, okay? You don't have a best friend. That's you know probably why? O'Malley, then. You your church! Knowing other people just waters down the experience. Live the dream, buddy. Shove it, dick snipper. Hey, Caboose. Come on, dude. 
Seriously? Have you paid attention to our enemies for one second? I beg your pardon? First of all, that guy, he's not yellow. He's orange. Okay. Girl, I've heard that much. My favorite thing is pretty dresses. Arr, oh, who, there's somebody in the very that back. I just saw again. Southern accent. Arr. Do you have any tampons? Seriously, what is the matter with you people? Calm down. Yeah, Don't chill the fuck out. Sidekick. Hey, butt brunch. I'm Caboose the sidekick, not him. So shut your pie hole. Oh. Leonard, are you okay? Oh, please. That butt finger couldn't hit me. No, wait. I'm gonna die. Arr. Yeah, you did. There he is. Yeah, right there. I, I saw them. I saw him earlier. Let's go get him. Right, come on, Caboose. Let's go. I am sorry. Have we met? What? It's what? me, Church. I don't seem to have any memory of you. My name is Michael J. Caboose. Michael J. Caboose. You've got to be freaking kidding me. I just hope Tucker's doing a That's better job cool. out there. He's got a full name. Turn off the radios. God damn it! This isn't going very well at all. <clears throat> you okay, Lopez? No bueno, en tocar. Lopez, la pesado. Whatever <laughs> you big show off. How about you, Sheila? You still online? Affirmative. Okay, we should be close enough to hack into their radio frequency. Lopez, get inside Sheila and do your business. <coughs> what? That's oh really shit! Get inside. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm getting Remind really me to sweaty. Too off when we get back to base. Well, this is a devil of a peccadillo. Simmons, get on the squat box and tell Claire. Oh, red guy. Oh. Are you there? What? In what is goodness? that? Who is this? It's me, Tucker. I'm one of the blue guys. Oh, okay. Look, I don't have time to explain. But I need all of you guys to shut off your radios right now. Boy, it'll be a cold day in hell before I <laughs> you. Look, it's really important, all right? Normally, I would just shoot at you guys and steal your girlfriends, but today's different. Really? Steal your girlfriends? Trust me on this. Well, this is I steal your girl over here. <clears throat> that is an interesting and well thought out, not to mention clever and timely, I might add, proposition. <laughs> Simmons, would you care to deliver our rebuttal? <clears throat> oh, here we go. Suck it, Blue! Yeah, suck it, Blue! Suck it, blue. <laughs> now that's what I call an old school zinger. That in is... In your face, Blue Dude! In your face! <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Hurry up, Church! You're getting away! <clears throat> You'll never catch me! Okay, oh, let's go. like, what the hell? It's like an old-timey villain. You'll never catch me! Damn it! These guys are not backing down! Lopez? Looks like we're gonna have to go to plan B. Si, yo entiendo. Oh, what's this? What? What? La primera vez que ve sus pisadas Y su cuerpo de acero What? Betty's bloomers is on the radio now! <laughs> Sounds like the barrel drive of a retarded Mexican Sasquatch. <laughs> turn it off! Turn it off! Please, God, make it stop! Oh, man, it's cruel. Whoa. Oh, man. <laughs> Alright, O'Malley. This is it. From now on, if anybody makes my girlfriend cranky and psychotic, it's, it's gonna, gonna be, be me. Aw, <laughs> oh, that's sweet. Shut up, <clears throat> asshole. Never! The darkness will swallow you whole. Get in, O'Malley. You're just one big headache. And I got a whole pistol full of aspirin. What? I got half a really? mind to kill you. That's ridiculous. And the other half agrees. Oh, Church, that's just stupid. You're about to split. God, Church. Personality. Now you're just embarrassing yourself. <laughs> that's it. I've had that enough. Is Can't all take the puns, anymore. dude. Everybody, switch off your radio. Oh, no, sorry, nice. That's, that's a nice plan. A retarded Try Mexican Sasquatch. Boy. Oh, man. Ah. <laughs> it worked. Hey, turn off your radio, quick. Nice knowing you, O'Malley. But payback's a bitch, and so am I. Wait, Tex, we don't know if Tucker's had enough time. There's only one way to find out. Oh, I guess. Huh. He just disappeared. I expected, like, an echoing laugh, or, you know, like the smell of brimstone, at least. I don't smell any kind of smell. I don't think he's gone. Do you think that's weird, Tex? Tex? Oh. Tex, where'd you go? Okay. I think this is the last part. <coughs> episode. Holy fuck, dude! Thirty-four episodes in already. Tell me, dude. One minute we're talking about a hole in the wall. The next thing I know, you turn into Grumps McGirt. Sounded like you needed a lozenge. Threatened to eat my children. Not very cool. <laughs> what the hell? Jeez, did I really? I'm sorry. 
Something went wrong with my radio, and I heard this weird beeping. Hey, no honking. offense taken, dude. Don't got any kids anyway. What? Old Vic's been through the snip and stitch. I don't, if you know what I mean. I don't want to hear about that. Winky Blinky, the one-eyed sergeant's firing blanks. That's weird. <laughs> I have to deal with the vast deference. Yeah, I'll write it. I get enough. I get you. I need a vasectomy, dude. Look, I found something really weird here at Blood Gulch Outpost Alpha. Roger that. What did you find? It's, it's like a... It's like a thing. It's like a thing. What the fuck okay. does that mean? Thank you for the update. I'll be sure to alert to keep the staff. Sorry, I'm, I'm still one. a little dazed. It's a big thing. It, it's purple. It's a, it's a big purple thing. <gasps> oh, is that a ghost? Look, I don't know. It looks like some kind of alien artifact. Did the aliens have like a home base or something here? I don't know, dude. Why don't I just consult my extraterrestrial travel guide for you? <laughs> oh, look. They had a great series of alien bed and breakfast there. Lucky Never you. mind. Figure it out myself. Nothing about big purple things, though. Alright. <sighs> Doc okay, found a ghost. The next time he talks to me like that, I'm gonna tell him to go straight to H-E double hockey sticks. Really? Oh, I really shouldn't talk like that. I really shouldn't talk like that. Wow, what a pacifist. Him. Jesus. I'm taking his eyes. That's so <gasps> Whoa, that was unlike me. I must be stressed. O'Malley took over I'm fucking Doc! How's Sheila doing? I'm not gonna lie. It's not looking pretty. She may have... Twisted Fuck, dude! Possibly some structural damage. It could be a disc. You have absolutely no idea what you're talking about. Dude. No, not a clue. What about Tex? Any sign of her? No, Son no of Tex. A bitch. Is it unusual for her to disappear like that? When we were dating, she would sneak off all the time. But it was usually to sleep with other guys or to spend money that she had taken out of my wallet. <laughs> and since I don't have any money, and, well, no offense to you, Tucker, but you're a dick. Oh, oh. She's probably going to get Lopez's body then. Oh, oh. Griff, don't try to move too much. Son of a you bitch, Doc. The ordeal. Oh man, where am I? <clears throat> it was really touch and go there for a while, good buddy. But I did it. I pulled you through. Oh shit, oh, Griff is alive. I just worry. realized that. Holy Still shit! Here, How? He got time. run over by Focus a fucking tank. My right hand? Your left. Uh, note to self, cut off left hand. <laughs> Technically speaking, it's not really your left hand. Say what? I had to replace certain body parts that were severely damaged. <gasps> Is he a robot? And a few that atrophied from a lifetime diet of... Is he like a cyborg now? Wait, which body parts? Well, let's see. We had to start with the shoulder. Then we moved on down to the flank. Huh? Yeah, we couldn't really they find an anatomy book. Wow. So they used the a cow anatomy book. <laughs> over over I think it did the trick. And of course, the brisket. Wait. And the hawk. Wait. Where did you get the Our replacement parts? Why, from our other subject, of course. Subject my cyborg ass. No way. Oh. Yeah. I'm real happy about this myself, numbnuts. Yep, those do. Did I get your lips? Very always. I figure out how to kiss Sarge's ass. <laughs> what the hell? That was nice. What didn't I get? We pretty much replaced all the internal organs and some of the more disgusting external ones. Except for Simmons' spleen, which will be inflated and used for general recreation and esprit de corps. This doesn't seem physically possible. Nonsense. Modern technology makes anything possible. Yeah, pretty it was much. It's as easy as shake and bake. And I helped. <laughs> and I helped. Okay, that was it. That is all the parts. Oh my god. Oh, wow. So, we found out about O'Malley. So, O'Malley wasn't really Caboose. It's Michael J. Caboose. So, his name's Michael. So, his name's Caboose. <clears throat> we found out O'Malley's really the AI, which has now taken over Doc. So, they have to fight him again and go through that whole process again. Uh, no idea where Tex is. She's probably trying to find another body or get to Lopez. Maybe. Perhaps. Not sure. Um... But, oh man, this was an interesting episode. Or this was an interesting run of episodes. Shed some light on the Caboose thing, because that was kind of like, when the hell are we going to know what's happening? And I never really thought of it like that. I considered, um... I considered... I guess I was kind of close then, because I said that Caboose would have been in the same program as Tex, given his aggressive nature and change of personality, but essentially it was just the fact that the AI was put into him. So it was almost... I was super close to that. But uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys pretty soon for part three. Thanks for watching.